Well, we went shopping. Shopping today at the Kenworth. Kenworth of Central Florida and Tampa. Had to get some uh had to get some stuff. Let's see what we got going on today. Alright. Well, first things first. I'll show you. We had to get a couple seals for our gas cap. The uh yeah, I'll show you, show you here a little bit. And we had the, this uh, little tube deal. It goes from like the, the uh, radiator to the engine. It'll start into a leak. I'll show you, I'll show you where that was going on. And we had to get a light, light for the trailer. Easy fix. Yeah, the light was about, about 18 bucks. But those, the two seals in the, the gaskets, the, the two gaskets were $34 a piece. And the hose cool, two and a half inch, 62 bucks. $103 at the Kinderworth. That's probably like the cheapest anyone's ever paid got out of there. <laughs> but uh, yeah, let me show you the... Uh, tanks you can see like all this here you know all that all that wasn't there when I bought the truck it was all clean so I'm just hoping that those gaskets got to be replaced same thing on the other side you know yeah I, don't, I don't, you know I know we spill fuel from time to time but but, but not that much so Hopefully we can get those uh, seals popped on and popped off there, and we can uh, hopefully that'll resolve the issue. All right, so it just looks like a I don't know what size wrench. We'll have to grab that, but uh, fix that. But you can see right here, see where it's starting to come down. So that's the culprit over there. So you can see where it's spraying down over here so so we're gonna go ahead and replace that clean this before somebody sees it and they shut her down so yeah ooh, it's all the way up here it's all over the place so we're gonna get that all cleaned up get that thing replaced all right so take the cap off there's like a tiny little screw I just used a pair of pliers and took it the rest of the way off. Obviously, you don't want to let this thing fall. You don't let the screw fall in there. You know, it's, it's in there good. So you just kind of lay it off to the side. So if you need this gasket, part number 12105GTD. Packar, Packar, Packar. They put their name on everything, man. Ugh. come right out don't look that bad hopefully this one's just a little bit get this baby in there all right Let's put this back on there Easy. All right. Hopefully that. Hopefully that will resolve some of the issue. The seal don't actually. Well, there's a couple little spots right there. It don't look that bad. But all right. Let's do the other side. All right. Let's get this one off here. This one's all kind of 
tangled up a little bit here. There we go. Let me take this little Alright. That's been bugging me for a little while. Alright. Where you at? There you are. Hopefully this helps. I know I'm gonna lose a little bit just from it sloshing around and stuff, but This one just actually seems to look just a little bit thicker. I don't think you suppose I should put a little bit of put a little bit of glue down there or nothing. Eh, there's no glue on there, so we're just gonna leave it the way it is and. Maybe I will come back later, put a little bit of glue on there, if it continues. Done deal. All right. All right. So let's uh, let's jump up front and see if we can take that little pipe off or the little hose off. All right. Here we go. There we go. Five sixteenths. Push you off to the side. And when you know, I left the <laughs> left the other one down there. Crap. Let's see if this thing will just... Oh yeah. <laughs> I'll lose a little bit of coolant with this one. That's for sure. Hopefully it won't be too bad. <clears throat> Yeah, we lost a little bit. That's all right. Let's go get the other one right quick. <laughs> ah, where's it at? the other where you at where you at oh man I lost one crap oh no I didn't no I didn't all right Man, this thing is a little tight.
Huh. Just gotta Man. <laughs> that was a close one. Just looking at it over here, making sure everything's alright. I thought I lost the other one, but I forgot I threw it to the side. <laughs> oh man. Well, I wasn't really expecting to lose that much coolant. Luckily we got some in the truck there. We can uh After we get everything all cleaned up, start the truck, let it run for a while. Because I know I didn't lose that much. Nothing that's really going to make a difference. Maybe I'll move it down just a little bit. You know what we may do? Oops, wrong way. We may just take it down to the... Come on now. There we go. Here's a little car wash down the street. We may just take it down there. Spray off the engine right quick. All right, right there. Get this bad boy on here. Oops. Let's go down and check this thing out real quick. I don't see any visual cracks. A little bit worn in the inside. Oh. I don't know if you can see, there's just a tiny little, a tiny little crack. There's some wearing, eh, maybe not just dirt. Got a little bit of a right here somewhere I could feel it. It's a little bit of a crack. It's starting to tear. There's one over here. It's like right on the you can see where the uh where the other clamp was on there. Kind of kind of right there. That's all right. We'll probably keep this thing for a backup. You never know. You never know. All right, let's get cleaned up here. Oh yeah, we lost some coolant. Here's the minimum. <laughs> I'm down here. So uh, yeah, let me go grab some coolant. We'll dump in here. All right. All of a sudden. I think I just realized that I may not have enough. Well, let's see here. Eh, it'll get me to the minimum anyway. Oh no, hold on everybody. 
Where's my funnel? Grab the funnel! Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. We're gonna have to go up to the store tomorrow and grab some. That's all we got. We out. We out. Thank goodness having that little extra. I'm gonna have to get some more. All right, that's that's good. All right, it's like actually the easiest job of all. Back up a little bit, and uh, actually don't even need no tools. Just a regular, you know, trailer marker light, three prong. All right. So just push it. Yeah. Unplug it. Actually, future if you do this, put your little seal. Ah, I did it wrong. Did it wrong. Put your seal in there first. Boom. Find your little pluggy deal. Come on, where you at? Come on, get in there. There you go. Oh, maybe not. Hold on. I can't see it! Ugh. Pretty tight back here. Come on. Giving me problems. Oh dang, I keep hitting that thing. There we go. I don't think it's in all the way. <laughs> We're having difficulties here, people. All right, all right. What's the story here? All right, should be that easy, right? That easy, right? Boom, all right. All right, go back to the truck. Make sure everything's working. Got this thing in right, it's all, oh man. Look at this. I'm sitting here freaking out. I'm like, why isn't the freaking trailer lights coming on? Ding, 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 ding. There you go. <laughs> so this marker light was out. It was flashing. But it wasn't coming on, so it's on. Let's turn the flashers on four ways. Make sure we're good. There we go. Forgot to forgot to plug the pigtail in. Man, I'm all like, what the heck's wrong with this thing, man? 
I got a bigger problem than I thought. All right, you're flashing down there. All right, all right, we did it. Cow. Easy, easy job. Just make sure you plug the lights in.